last night I was watching a lot of YouTube and I was like sort of um, streaming a bunch of them, like um, binging a lot of these ones with narcissists and things. Um, and one lady was talking all about how the narcissist will program things into their phone for their other supply, like spam caller. So when the phone's ringing and if they answer or don't answer, you think it's spam um, or, or family friend or cousin or somebody. I'm like, oh my gosh. And like so many of those things happened in my last relationship. So many things, I mean, I kind of knew I knew, but like when you are confirmed that it happens to other people and you see these videos and they're talking about the same things you've went through, the very same things, you sometimes they'll have excuses like, I don't have money for this or whatever. I remember he did that because, you know, he was taking trips and getting tattoos with the other supply at the same time as then coming and hanging out with me and then would run out of money or complain about it. Also had drinking problems and some other issues. But anyway, we live and learn. Um... Sometimes it's just better to be single, you know, than to settle for something like that. I'm quick to cut bait and run. A lot of people will stay. I can't stay. There's no staying in that situation. Anyway, I'm just playing with a filter here, having fun. I hope you have a great evening. And if this resonates, drop a line. But for sure, you know, some of us, some of us have gone through stuff. You know, it started when we were younger. And we're programmed with certain things with our family and how to sort of people please or cater to other people when we should just be catering to ourselves and we forget who we are. We need to like refigure all that out so you know going to therapy all these things for years and years and years and learning so anyway that's just a quick message for this evening and I hope you're having a great weekend and love you